Alrighty, so leveling up and uh, constitution and uh, vitality. While this spell is active, the mage radius arcane energy every few seconds emitting waves of projectiles that deal spirit damage to enemies within the field. Each projectile consumes a small amount of mana. Uh, right. So... But I do want to go up this road. I do, I do, I do, I do. I do want to go up and get of neutralization. So, um, mystical negation. I actually think I'll do this. So we dealt with everything downstairs found some stuff for you. Oh, you're back to visit old Dworkin? Yes. You're in luck. I found some lyrium sand. Splendid. Truly splendid. We've enough lyrium sand to keep us busy for a long time. Thanks for your help. Please, take these. Use them to give those beasties a what for. <laughs> some more high explosives. <coughs> Let's go check here. You're back. You need anything? See you, oh, Of course. And, um, this is actually quite nice. Wait. I'm sure I put this in my box. Reduced emblem, cold resist spell power, fire damage. I'm going to go into the keep and put stuffs in my box. Unless I was stupid enough to sell. No, I didn't sell. Cheer Pasa. up. No one loves a grump. For a dead woman, you're remarkably perky. I could be less perky if you like. The darkness of the deep roads has seeped into my soul. The world is dead. My heart is black. Alas. Whoa. Whoa. Let's stick to Perky. <laughs> yes. Hey, Commander. We need to talk. Um Of course, Ogren. Dreams. You get them. Uh, this is a Grey Warden thing, huh? Why didn't anyone tell me? <clears throat> wow. Um, at least this isn't the blight. You hear the archdemon. Can't imagine he has anything interesting to say. In my dream, I saw one of those bloated, vomit-smeared brood mothers, and it had Hespeth's face. <laughs> Hespeth was Bronca's lover in the deep roads. Yeah, sodding poetess with her poetry. Bronca was there, and whispered, it's time, and Hespis screamed, and a thousand darkspawn burst from her. That's strange. You're telling me. Then the darkspawn surrounded me and started talking, asking me if I would like lemon in my tea. And could I please teach them to read and write, and, and one of them kept repeating, where's the baby? And that's when I woke up. Right. <clears throat> That's not a Grey Warden dream. Huh. Well, I do get other dreams about Darkspawn. Mostly shadows and murmuring. But nowhere is scary. Thanks <laughs> for listening, Commander. Um, what was I supposed to do? 
what am I supposed to do? I want to... Oh yes, I want to put stuff in my storage. I want to put Kalak there. And I want to put Parsa there. And then... Um, God, I have so many things here I really don't need. Uh, let's do some enchanting and stuff. May I be of service? Yes, enchanted. Of course. Right. <clears throat> so, um... Wait, just a second. I should have... Don't we have... Don't we have rune slots on our... Guess not. May oh, I be wait. of service? Yes, 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 yes. Of course. Um, so... Um, quick by Ogrim. There was one thing that wasn't... equipped by anyone. I must have sold it. <laughs> <coughs> I probably sold it. Okay, never mind. I wanted to take a look at Oh Grounds. Oh damage spell resistance attack. Dark spawn. Yes, let's do this. Do you have a crossbow? Beastmaster, yes. Okay. Um, and ice bolts. Okay. So, if we rip those away... May I be of service? Of course. If we rip away the darkspawn ravager... And give him... This... <clears throat> Fine, and let's move on. I want to go. So, this is what it looks like now. We need to. No, none of that is important. This is not important. We're going to deal with these once we go back to Amaranthin. And... And... Um... Oh, the race. Vengeance, find and destroy the brace. I can't remember how to do that. Um, yes, 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 and yes. But, oh, here we are. Um, so we have investigate the Black March, uh, Christoph, and investigate the Wending Wood. Mavis believed Darkspawn are disrupting trade routes in the Wending Wood. He asked you to intervene. Um, this is much more urgent, I feel. Uh, we need to find Kristoff. So, and for that, I need Ogre's uh, tank. I yes. need my rogue, and yes. I need my extra mage healer. And we are. We are going to... Have you ever thought of returning to Ozama? Not sure I can. Technically, I'm a surface dwarf now. Why technically? You don't know for certain? It's not like they send you a letter. Congratulations! You've been ejected from the warrior caste. Do you care? Sometimes. Then I drink more and it goes away. Oh, okay, I feel a bit for him, you know. Um, <coughs> so, 
so there we go and uh, maybe maybe I'll, I'll teach him to become a reaver you know I'll influence him that might might work somehow maybe he needs more cunning. I'll just slap that in there then. And um, so onslaughts and reading storm. So onslaughts and reading storm is sustained. Berserk is sustained. This is sustained. <laughs> Sorry, I should do this. Off camera. You still got to level up. Oh. Well. <coughs> well. Well. Um. I guess I'll have to save that then, unless I'll go for clarity and give him some more stamina. I could do this, you know. It's quite a lot. If you look at this, this is without. So this is him now. And then I'll give him more stamina. It's quite a bit there. Right? It's good. I'll do that. You know, I don't know why I did that, but I just did it. Oh no, why did you put the points there? Yada yada. Let's move out. Wait. I had stuff in here I wanted to sell. Uh, the crossbow. And... Oh god, I don't know. you want this? No, you don't. And then I have all these things. I'm gonna go sell stuff. I need room. Who are you? Lilith? Do you remember me? The merchant from the road. I've made a deal with your mistress Wolsey to provide some new stock for the other merchants here. Make her bless you, sir. Okay. Huh? I missed her before. You're back. Yes. You need anything? Yes. Oh. So this, this, this can be sold, and this, and this, and this, and this. This. Um, there's just one thing, though. I need to buy ogre and new stuff as well because this is only tier one. So I'll do that off camera. Uh, I just want to show you this: that there are some rune slots on this armor. If you look, let's look at the one I just bought for ogre. Grey wards and heavy armor. And as you can see, there are rune slots. But once I bought it, they are they have disappeared. So anyway, I'm, I'm gonna uh, equip this on Ogrim now.
can sell that stuff. You're back. You need it. So, spending a lot of money on equipping my soldiers, but that's fine. Um... So... Armor penetration attack. This is nice. Fanny? No. Uh, six defense, fire resistance. Oh, these things are... I don't know. Five spell power. <coughs> Will power. Eh, I'm just gonna clutter my bag with them. Yes. Let's move on. We're going to find Kristoff. By the way, it seems to be not night anymore. That's nice. So, uh, instead of going down here, we are avoiding the Wending Wood and going to the Black March. Say this marsh was once inhabited until one day everyone disappeared. Yeah, you would know that. You're from around here, don't you? Aren't you? The rickety old sign reads Beware the Black March is haunted. Okay. Nice fish thing. I thought I saw a. I mean. <clears throat> Code accepted. Cool. What the blight does not destroy, it corrupts. Any creature infected with the dark spawn taint that does not have the good fortune to die outright becomes a ghoul, a twisted shadow of itself. The name originally came from men, whether human, dwarven or elven, who became tainted usually while being held as a captive food source by the darkspawn. They would turn cannibal, preying on other captives, slaves to the will of the archdemon driven mad by pain. During a blight, the corruption of the darkspawn spreads through the wilder areas of Thedas and infects the animals found there. This produces grotesque enraged enraged bears called a berserkan as well as blight wolves. Fortunately, ghouls ra rarely survive their corruption. Flop. Okay then. Oh, can you pick this up for me? <laughs> Are you itchy, Ogren? My father used to tell me stories about the Black Marsh when I was young. He said evil magic killed everyone here. This was just before the rebellion. A great mystery at the time. Hmm. What evil magic could have caused this? They never found out what happened here. Once the monsters appeared, the marsh was abandoned. I used to dream of coming to the Black Marsh and setting things right. Little boy dreams. <laughs> You're doing it now, aren't you? <laughs> um, no, I'm, uh, I'm a mage. The veil is thin here. There's no repair. True enough. I did say it was a fantasy, didn't I? The Black Marsh is dead. If someone had told me I'd end up here, 
I would have laughed at them. But times change. When I was in Kirkwall, I thought I would return to Ferelden to take command of my father's garrison. Now, here I am. A Grey Warden and fighting both Darkspawn and demons. Interesting. <laughs> yes, isn't it? I, love my job. <laughs> I don't imagine there are many who would agree with us. Anyway, the Haunted Marsh awaits. Oh, he approves, does he? You know, Nathaniel, you're just like me. Am I now? Everyone hates your family for something terrible they did, even though you weren't involved. I hope you have a point, Anders. It's like you're a mage. If there were more hows, they'd lock all of you up in a tower to protect everyone else. A thrilling analogy. <laughs> Blood Lotus. Yeah, there we go. Wait us if they know what's good for them. How I can do this. Follow Corrin's trail to find Bonnie's surprise. You found the remains of a man who named Corrin who drank poison after his level Bonnie left him. A note found in Corrin's skeletal hand indicates Bonnie was upset over a trail of riddles. The first clue, you are my hen, the mistress of my flock. You nourish my body and tend to my rooster. I don't know if we're gonna do that. I don't know if Leonie cares about stuff like that. Maybe her followers um, like to wait a moment wait just a moment When I was a child, I visited a traveling fair that had an entire dragon skeleton on exhibition. <coughs> Find the scattered dragon bones. You look at it, the dragon skeleton, but it's still missing four bones. What is that? It looks like something ghostly. Almost like the Fade. Oh, you two are so cute when you stand like that. You think that's a good idea? Oh, please do rethink that. <laughs> okay, so it's not possible to pass. So. I just wanted to find this place first. So let's go up to the house. Well, all right. Dead. Kristoff's doing maybe. That answers that, I suppose. The Darkspawn are definitely here. Uh, you found a slave Darkspawn, possibly a sign that Kristoff was here. 
Lost beneath the trees. Okay. <laughs> Lost beneath the trees. He lifts a weary head and sees her burning, <laughs> burning love. Lights his way home. Merchant's cash. The merchant in the black mart portrayed several young women in exchange for treasures from the Baroness. Overpowered by guilt, he soon killed himself. The merchant's suicide note contains a map hitting. Uh, I don't care about that. Uh, Custom's Wild. Custom's Wild's last testament. They came to me for help. These three maidens of the black march. They were young, beautiful, vital, everything she desires. They gave me gold, jewels, and family heirlooms. I imagine their mothers and fathers and uncles and brothers pressing those treasures into their hands, enough to ransom a life promised to the Baroness. I agreed to spirit them away from the Black Marsh. She learned of it. She appeared the night before. Her eyes were like flat, dull stones, her hair st stringy and streaked with grey. And I saw why she needed the woman. I hid them in my wagon. The youngest embraced me before she crawled between the bales of hay. She said, make a blessing watch over you. I drove them through the crossroads where the baroness man, man waited. He took the wagon. Their families never knew. The witch, as good as her words, brought me a chest of gold. 
She twirled like a little girl, eyes now sparkling. You've earned every bit, merchant. The girl was no comfort. I saw their faces on each sovereign, heard their voices in the tinkling of the coins. I couldn't bear it. I buried it all in the deepest past part of the march. Still, I found no peace. There will be no peace for me until I stand before the maker. Karsten Wilde. <coughs> and attached is a map. Lovely. Alright. There's a chest in here. Of course. So. So, yes. <coughs> Sorry. Once dusted off, this reads This village lies abandoned. May the maker rest upon their poor souls. way uh-huh hmm. records of the black march some years ago, a dragon rampaged through the countryside, gorging herself on animals and people. Before long, she nested near the village of Backmarsh. Fearing she would drag, drag off villagers to feed her young, we sent men to drive the beast away. The men were never seen again. The new baroness had till then done little for her people, but she emerged from her manor and told us not to worry. She'd been sent from Orlais, not just to rule, but to protect. She promised the dragon would be gone by sundown the next day. She set off in the morning, alone. We were certain she'd gone insane. What chance had one woman against a dragon? At sundown there came a loud clap, like thunder, so great it shook the earth. Then our baroness returned to us, triumphant. Of the dragon there was no sign. The baroness, no longer aloof, sang and danced with the lowest of us. There were dark whispers that the Baroness was a witch, but we did not care. Her magic had saved us, and for that we loved her. Oh well. And this is something that Ogun picked up, so he's going to get to keep it. What's this? A baby's plaything? You wanted a pony. Wait, you paid attention to what I said when I was drunk? Oh, that's special. Ooh, hey, wanna buy a bridge? Too bad it's not a real pony, huh? <laughs> uh, just as well. The real one's poop. This is... <laughs> You make me laugh, Commander. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> oh, he really approved. Yeah, okay. So, um, I'm going to make a cut here. Okay, I'm gonna make a cut here, so thanks for watching, and don't know when I'll be back, because tomorrow I'm going to go and buy Thief for... Okay, bye.